Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to create a simple Java project and uh, deploy that to Google Cloud uh, platform. Prerequisites for this uh, video is Eclipse has to be installed and Java version 8 or 11 has to be installed on your system. And also uh, Google Cloud uh, Platform SDK must be installed. And also uh, Google Cloud Platform Tools uh, plugin has to be installed on your IDE. Where you can install is go to Eclipse Marketplace and search for Google. and Google Cloud Tools for Eclipse, you have to install this. I have already installed. And once your uh, Google SDK is installed on your uh, system, you will be able to see this. And you have to install uh, G Cloud components list. You can see the list of the components that are available in your uh, Google Cloud platform. It will give you the list. And the one which I want is components install app engine Java. all the components are up to date. I have already installed, but in order to uh, create a Java project, this has to be installed. Now, let's create a new project in Eclipse IDE. Once uh, that uh, plugin is installed, like uh, previously as I was showing how to install that from Marketplace, once it's uh, installed, you are prompted to uh, restart your Eclipse ID. Once it gets restarted, you will be able to see this icon here. Create a new project. And instead of sign into Google account, you must be able to see manage Google account. That, this means you are already signed into your uh, Google Cloud uh, uh, account. So let's create a new standard Java project and let's give name as test and I'll click on finish. This will automatically generate the code here. Where I can see this is here. We can see what is there inside this particular uh, and also make sure that main web app web inf this app engine web dot xml file must be inside your uh, web inf uh, folder and now let's run this uh, particular using app engine now i got um, output this app engine is running on localhost and when i click on the servlet it will display hello app engine and now this is running on localhost now we have to get the same output when we deploy this particular app test app inside our google uh, cloud platform let's go to google cloud and let's create a project new project and let's give project name as test and you click on create that will create a test project and once uh, it gets created 
select the project and here we have to install app engine on uh, this particular uh, project that we have created on left hand side uh, choose app engine and then create application create app and choose java here standard and now app engine is getting created once it gets created let's deploy uh, the java project that we have created inside our application eclipse ide you can see this option right deploy to app engine standard let's do that once app engine gets created and prior to this uh, you should be uh, giving uh, access uh, to that uh, particular role whatever the role you are having you have to give uh, access uh, in order to uh, access buckets or projects whatever you should have uh, access in order to deploy this particular app to google cloud platform now since the app engine is uh, ready let's deploy our test project deploy to app and let's choose uh, it will list the uh, projects that are available in google cloud platform that is linked to my account you will be able to see your account here and the list of projects uh, associated with that account and i'm choosing test here and choose deploy and on bottom of your uh, eclipse ide you will be seeing deploying to app engine once this is done uh, you will be able to see output now you are able to see this output on localhost right uh, then you will be able to see in the google cloud platform associated link let's wait till this application gets deployed to google cloud platform We are going to see output in this uh, target URL. Once uh, this deploying is 100%, then when you click on this target URL, you will be able to see the same output, what, whatever we are seeing here. And also, uh, In order to do this uh, uh, Google App Engine in your Eclipse, you have to either use uh, Java 8 or Java 11. Where you can see that is, you can go to Windows and you can click on Preferences. You can choose Java. And here install JREs. Here you will be able to see uh, the version of the uh, JDK that has been installed. Minus 11 version. Now, uh, this deploy is uh, successfully completed and now when uh, we clip this particular link it is automatically opened this particular link let's open so this is working and when you click on the servlet you will be able to uh, see hello app engine the output whatever we are uh, seeing previously through local host 
Now you are able to see the same output through Google Cloud Engine. Thank you.